More than 600,000 Muslim Rohingya have fled to Bangladesh since late August driven out by a military clearance operation in Buddhist-majority Myanmar's Rakhine state. The Rohingya's suffering has caused an international outcry. Visiting the Myanmar capital Napiata, Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi said China believed that the issue could be addressed by a solution acceptable to neighbors Myanmar and Bangladesh through consultations. A ceasefire should be followed by bilateral dialogue to find a workable solution, the ministry website reported late on Sunday. The third and final phase should be to work towards a long-term solution. Wang said a ceasefire was basically in place already, and the key now was to prevent a flare-up. He hoped the two sides could soon sign and implement an agreement already reached on repatriation. The international community and the United Nations Security Council should give encouragement and support to both countries to create the necessary conditions and a good environment, it quoted Wang as saying at a joint press conference with Aung San Suu Kyi, Myanmar's de facto leader. Myanmar was supportive of the Chinese plan, as was Bangladesh, where Wang visited earlier in the weekend. Indaka Wang said the international community should not complicate the situation.